Stephen, it ends in defeat to open the UEFA Youth League campaign. How would you summarise that match? Uh, listen, we're, dis we're bitterly disappointed, obviously, with the result in the game. But the first thing that we, the most important thing for us, is we, we, we look at the performance and um, the performance with the boy. We just lack that wee bit of belief at this level, and, and, and sometimes that's what you can get. Um, this is the first game of the competition. The boys will learn. The last two games have been a brilliant learning curve for the boys because they've never experienced that kind of feeling before. So it's two good teams that we've played against in West Ham and Feyenoord and, and the boys will be better for it. Um, we'll be better prepared for it as, 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 as a group, as individuals, and we'll do whatever we can to help the players. That's their job. If it's, there's, there's no smooth ride when in somebody's first team. Our job is to try and produce young players that can play either in our first team or the boys that are going to then go and have a career. So these games are an invaluable experience for these boys to, to, to play against some real genuine quality. Yeah, at this stage of the career, it's always a learning curve. What do you think they can take from this game today? Even you can see it, was a, it felt a proper game. You know, there's, there's fans in, there's a good intensity to your play. You're playing against an opposition who move the ball very well, so your shape's got to be good out of possession. You need problem solving the pitch. You're up against good athletes, so um, the boys all felt that certainly in the last two games. But but what they, we see all the time, the, the, the boys are desperate to learn, they're desperate to improve, they're desperate to get better. So it's their job to then help them with that as well. That's one fixture down, but there's still another five remaining. It's a long campaign ahead. It's, it's different games, you know. There's different games when you play away from home in Europe, and that's what the, the, the whole point of this competition is: is for the boys to to, to feel what, and, and, uh, what European football is all about, and what Champions League football is going to be about. Hopefully, for further on in their career, um, there were some good moments, but probably just not enough, you know. And like you said, the, we just felt as if they kind of lack real, genuine belief in how good they are individually and how good they can be as a team. And when you when you give good players time and space, they hurt you. Is it just a case of to improve across those games as they come? Listen, that's that's what it is. You know, you, last year we played 55, 56 games, and it's the same procedure that you go through. You 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 prepare them for the game, you play the game, you then do a, a, a post-match analysis because that's what the players learn. And that's our job as, as, as a staff together to try and to try and help them along in this journey. So um, it's not going to be any different. We'll watch the game back, we'll analyse the game back, and hopefully we can we can take as much from it as we possibly can to make the players better.